Welcome to Violin Adventures number 139. We're going to start off by getting that child's violin out of circulation. Let's see what happens to it. Okay, here we are with our sophisticated project. <laughs> okay, so I really enjoyed all everyone who tried to guess what am I doing and you'll probably figure it out now. But let's hope that this turns out all right. Okay, it's just getting uglier and uglier. Okay, here is our progress. Here's what it looks like right now. Here's this ugly old violin. Very bad, we took it out of circulation and this is what it looks like. Okay, I'm pretty happy with this. I'm going to put a ribbon up here so that it can hang on the wall. And if any of you are interested, just let me know. More work on the new cello. Here we are at our cello table. Look at all the mountains of wood chips and we're just beginning. We've still got a long way to go. But at this point we have the height where we want it. And what I'm going to do next is just go around all the edges, making sure they're, they're smooth, which they're not right now. And they're uneven, so getting around that then I'm also going to go around the top on the edges and make sure they're not bumpy and lumpy and they're all consistent in thickness. And then, um, then we can probably get going on scraping this. We just have a little more work to do um, to get the hardest part done. We want to be very careful and uh, make sure everything is just right before we turn it over. And that will go a lot faster. So here we go. So we're going to go around one more time around this perimeter. Well, I hope you can see in the background all the mountains of maple. And I've been chipping away at the inside of this scroll, the peg box, and I realized I haven't shown you guys anything here. So
going around the edges here, just blending the lower section up with the bigger section so it all flows. So now we're on to scraping and you can see that this is much finer. Just these are like powder. Freddie is having so much fun. on the scroll. Our professor is back.
Freddie wants to chat. Hi everyone, I'm Freddie, and I've been having so much fun playing in the wood chips. I got chips all over me, and, and my mom doesn't like that because she has to clean me all up. But anyway, we got some projects. I got a project here. I'm going to show you the bees. Just put the honey in there. Boy, they're, they're busy. So, is that anything? No, I think it's... Oh, there, that's a lot of eggs. Wonder if the queen's over here. Oh, man, okay. But let's see, do we see any? Yeah, new eggs right in here. They haven't been covered. Okay. So, we got a queen somewhere. We got a queen. Well, that tells me a lot. Well, I hope you guys like that. See you next time. Don't forget to send in your projects. Bye. Hanun Val Rahum Hashem Erech Apaim Ugadol Chesed Tov Hashem Lachol Gracious and merciful or compassionate is the Lord, slow to anger and great in kindness. The Lord is good to all. If you know where this is found, please leave it in the comments below. Okay, here we are Friday afternoon beautiful sunny day. Let's go in inside and see what is going on in there. Here we are in the shop. We got a lot of good progress done this week. Let's take a look. Okay, here's the back, the top of our back. And we've got it all smoothed out and scraped. So it's, it's not final smoothing, but it's looking pretty good. We've started on the back side here. So the scroll is roughed out and it's looking pretty good. And we still need to go down deeper here in our peg box. So we have a lot of work left to do there. And over here on this table is our decorative violin. So there it is. There's our decorative violin. And maybe that'll hang on the wall in someone's home. Hi everyone, it's dusk out here and I'm enjoying the beautiful weather. It's just nice and cool and everything's beautiful. But I wanted to get on here and let you know that there probably won't be any violin adventures for the next two weeks. I've got family coming this week and next week and I want to spend time with them. So I don't think I'll be getting any. So if you don't see the adventures, don't worry. Lord willing, I'll be back in a couple weeks. Well, thank you so much for watching and for all your wonderful comments and for your thumbs up. And thank you to all the new subscribers. And until next time, God bless you. Bye.